you need the Microsoft Office suite of apps for your business, school, or personal life, the cost can be very expensive with plans starting at around $70 per year. Thankfully, there are ways to use their most popular apps like Word, Excel, and PowerPoint at zero cost to you. So in this video, I'll show you all the ways you can use Microsoft Office for free. Coming up next on Tech Combo. The first of six ways is to use Office on the web, which is now the official name. Some of you might remember, it used to be called Office Online. It's 100% completely free and can be used in your favorite web browser. You will need a Microsoft account. If you don't have one, click on Sign Up for Free. It's easy to get set up. Included with Office on the web is Microsoft Word. For working with spreadsheets, there's Excel. And for presentations, there is PowerPoint. Also included is OneNote, Outlook, Sway, which is their Canva alternative, and a few others. When you open Office on the web, you'll see the most popular web apps along the left. Clicking on apps will show you the others available. When you select Word, Excel, or PowerPoint, you'll see the templates or themes here along the top, along with a link to get additional themes or templates. Or to start from scratch, using Word as an example, you can select New Blank Document. The web apps for Office only offer the basic features when compared to the desktop version, but for most people that won't be a problem. At the top you'll see the familiar ribbon to edit your document. I do want to point something out. When you go to File here in the upper left and select Save As, this will save your document online to Microsoft's cloud storage service, OneDrive. If you prefer to save it to your computer, select Download a Copy. Here's what Microsoft Excel looks like on the web. And here's PowerPoint with the templates here on the right. The Office on the Web apps, because they are browser-based, can be used with any operating system, including Windows, Mac, Linux, and can even be used on Chromebooks. We'll now go through the remaining five of these more quickly. If you're a student or teacher, you may be able to get Office 365 education for free. To find out if you're eligible, enter your school email address and click Get Started to go through the registration process. The great thing is, this is not a trial. You'll get access to the entire Office suite, including Microsoft Teams, with all the features included, as long as you're enrolled at a qualified grade school, college, or university. Not every school participates. If you do know that your school is enrolled with Office 365 Education and you get denied access, contact your institution's IT department to allow access. If you have an iOS or Android device, you can get Microsoft Office for free to view, create, and edit Word, Excel, and PowerPoint documents all in one app. There is a catch. On devices with a screen size larger than 10.1 inches, you can install Office to view documents, but you will need a paid account to edit and create them. You can download Microsoft Office for Android from the Google Play Store, and if you have an iPhone or iPad, it's available from the Apple App Store. Another way to get Microsoft Office for free is to find a friend, roommate, or family member with a Microsoft 365 family plan, which allows for up to six users, and ask them nicely to add yourself to their account. You'll be able to get full access to all the apps on any device with OneDrive storage up to one terabyte. To do this, the owner will need to add you on the Microsoft account sharing webpage, and then you'll receive an invitation link. If you're in the market for a new computer, you can sometimes get one year of Microsoft Office 365 Personal included for free. It's not much, but at least you're saving around $70. I've mostly seen these deals with new laptops, so I'll put a few we recommend in the description with various price points. If you're someone that only needs temporary access to the fully featured version of Microsoft Office, or you just want to kick the tires before buying an annual plan, you can get a one month trial of Microsoft 365 Family for free. To sign up for the trial, you'll need to enter your credit card information. If you don't want to use it after the trial, make sure you cancel. Otherwise, it will automatically renew after the trial ends at around $100 per year. In addition, Microsoft also offers Microsoft 365 for Business with a one month free trial. Taking advantage of both offers could net you two months of Microsoft Office for free. Just like the other trial offer, cancel before the trial ends to avoid getting charged. If none of those methods work for you, or you just want to get out of Microsoft's ecosystem, we released a video a few months back with free alternatives to Microsoft Office that might work better for you. The link to that video will be in the description. 
Thanks for watching. If this video is useful for you, do us a favor and give this video a thumbs up and share with others. Links to the websites mentioned are in the description. Do let us know in the comments the method you plan to use to get Microsoft Office for free. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe and click the bell for additional free software options and other tech-related stuff here on Tech Umbo.